Work. They say there are only 24 hours in a day, but I'm only up for three of them, and two I consider overtime. Cat proverb. I lick. I lick my neck, I lick my chest, I lick my back to look my best. I lick my paw to wash my face, I lift my leg to lick that place. I lick my tail, I lick my belly, I lick my back, or did I do that already? Um, I lick my tail, maybe once more, or what the hell, let's make it four. I lick my neck in case I forgot. Did I lick my chest? Well, I missed a spot. I lick my face, my leg, my tail, my face. I re-lick my belly and then, yes, my face. I lick all the time. I'm so soil free. Seems the only thing I can't lick is my OCD. Your keyboard. S U E T D H E 8 D E F D I S J A S. I just typed a poem in your presentation. C H S O T H E K S T E V D S W J. I just typed a joke. In your email. N O S Y D seven six M H D L W D A G. <laughs> I just typed something personal on your update. V O S seven S W P S eight S seven three W B K. I just typed my political views in your tweet. B H S T nine A H W dash two Y N S Y H Z. I just accidentally typed in your bank account password. Kitty's gonna buy himself a new scratching post. One day. One day. Words I shall talk. One day on my hind legs I shall walk. One day your books I shall read. One day I shall dress in your finest tweed. And on that day, when I walk and talk, when I know the facts and look stunning in slacks, when I am your equal and not under your command, I shall stride right up and fully demand, can you get my favourite fuzzy toy from under the bed? It's been there for like a week and I can't reach it. Busy, busy. <sighs> it's 8 a.m. and time to rest. It's 10 a.m. and time to relax. It's noon and time for repose. It's 3 p.m. and time for shut eye. It's 6 p.m. and time for siesta. It's 9 p.m. and time to slumber. It's midnight and time to snooze. It's 4 a.m. and time to hang upside down from your bedroom ceiling screaming. Scratch. Scratch, 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 scratch. <sighs> there, it is done. Now gaze upon your sofa leg and see an exact replica of Rodin's The Thinker. I mean, if you just look at it from the right angle. Anyway, on to my next masterpiece. Turning your curtains into confetti. <laughs> really? <laughs> I should have my own gallery by now. Talk to me. Tell me about your day. Tell me about your dreams. Tell me about the girl you adore. The one who smiles but walks away. Tell me your greatest fears. Tell me your greatest secrets. Tell me your most cherished moments. The ones that light your darkest days. Tell me why things don't work out. Tell me why stuff gets in your way. Tell me why it stops you cold, the one you thought 
you can't let go. Lie on the couch and talk to me. Open your mind and bear yourself because I think I finally figured out how to bill you and I'm about to make a fortune. Did you know? Did you know? Did you see? Did you count how many times I had to smack that moth on your forehead with my paw? It was like a thousand. He's dead now though. Definitely dead. One more smack. You're welcome. Nine lives. The first life is for running. The second life is for sharing. The third life is for climbing. The fourth life is for tearing. The fifth life is for sleeping. The sixth life is for sleeping. The, the seventh life is for sleeping. The eighth life is for sleeping. The ninth life is for um, writing my memoirs. I run. I run across the room. I race across the floor. I dash to this wall. I thought I saw something. I forgot what it was. Now everyone is staring at me. So I run back across the room. I race back across the floor. I dash back to that other wall so that everyone will think I'm just running laps. Tripped. I'm sorry I tripped you in the hall. I'm sorry I tripped you in the den. I'm sorry I tripped you in the bedroom. I'm sorry I tripped you in the kitchen. I'm sorry I tripped you in the attic. I am sorry I tripped you in the basement. I'm sorry I tripped you out the door. Oh, I'm sorry I tripped you on the hard cement. But some men paid me five grand to kill you. We're all in this together. I cleaned the floor with your sweater back and forth. I cleared the table with a few whips of my tail. I dusted your shelves of all the knickknacks you kept. I made your bed smell a lot more like me. I'm here to help. I want to do my part. After all, we're all in this together. Call me. You can call me muffins all you want but till you add sir at the start I'm not turning my head chicken and rice chicken and rice for the first day chicken and rice for the second day chicken and rice for the third day chicken and rice for the fourth day chicken and rice for the fifth day chicken and rice for the sixth day lamb and rice today Woo! And just like that, my world crumbles. And now we know. 995, I'm doing this for you. 996, so please don't interrupt. 997, I'm just keeping them honest. 998, so please do take note. 999. And now, thanks to me, we all know there really were 1,000 sheets in this toilet paper roll. <sighs> Kneel before me. In ancient Egypt, we cats were gods. We ruled the heavens, we reigned on earth. So kneel before me, I said, come to me. Huh? Listen to me. How about just a treat then? Okay, maybe a toy. Some crumpled paper would do. I'm not picky. Well, at least you can scratch behind my ear. Can you at least do that? Oh. Oh, yes. Oh, you serve your master well. <laughs> 